Today I'll be showing you how to install the UXP feeder connector. This one connector fits the most commonly used feeder cable on the market today. Today's demonstration I'll be using a UXP DIN female 7 8 connector. The installation process is the same for all feeder cables 7 8 inch to inch and 5 8 The tools required for this install are RD cutter, the SP7-8 prep strip tool with coin bits and guide pins. Depending on the cable, refer to your reference chart to determine which coin bit and guide pins to use. The Gator Center Conductor Cleaner. Alcohol Cleaning Wipe, which is included with every connector. The half inch frame set, with either the A insert for DIN connectors or the B insert for N connectors. The HCG Compression Tool. Cordless Power Drill. An adjustable wrench and either torque wrench for the N or DIN connectors, the TQ114F18 for DIN connectors, and the TW1412 for N connectors. Always wear safety glasses, do not use incorrect tools, and do not blow into prepped cable. Straighten cable and position cutter in the valley of the corrugations. Rotate the cutter evenly around the cable and cut the cable squarely. If you're using our weather protection system, our WPS5, insert the boot onto the cable now. Take a clean rag, wipe off the cable. Open blade lever and lock with pin. Insert cable, actuate the drill. Actuate the drill until the outer conductor reaches the fixed stop. This will remove the jacket. Make sure the blade is in the position over the valley. Release the blade lever and continue until the cable is completely cut. When the blade lever is shown fully closed, open the lever and lock with the pin. Remove the tool. Make sure the remaining cable is removed from the tool. Use an alcohol wipe that's included with the connector to clean the outer conductor thoroughly. Align the top of the outer conductor with the edge of the connector cap. Mark the cable using a pen or a marker in line with the end of the connector. Push and twist connector onto the cable until it reaches its mark. Push or pull back the insert to allow the connector to lie flat in the frame. Make sure the connector is fully seated. Press the HCG trigger tool until the gun cycles. Do not pull or push on the tool or cable during compression. Add port seal to connector, DIN female only, to ensure a moisture proof connection. The port seal should sit in the flat area behind the threads. When attaching to a feeder connector, be sure to support the feeder connector with a wrench during the tightening process.